Governor Abu Kefas of Taraba State says his administration has put in place security measures to make the state one of the safest places in the country for investors. Governor Kefas made the disclosure at the Exco Chamber of the Government House, Jalingo, when he received a team from the African Development Bank who are in the state to prepare for the takeoff of Phase 2 of their Special Agricultural Processing Zone, SAPZ. Our correspondent Jude Nuhu Gundali reports or his report is presented from our studio. Gathering here at the Exco Chamber Government House, Jalingo, are the members of a team of the African Development Bank on a courtesy visit to the governor. They were in the state to assess the readiness of the state for the commencement of the special agricultural processing zone in the state. Speaking on behalf of his members, Barrister Bashir Ibrahim Gaya, leader of the team, told the governor that the state has a lot of potential in agriculture, which, if well harnessed, will have the capacity to feed the entire country. We have over 27 states that has expressed interest for the second phase. And looking at the number of the state that has expressed interest, it's going to be quite impossible to have all the 27 states under the second phase of the SAPZ. So we are here to assess the readiness of the state and to make sure that the state is included in the second phase of SAPZ. Everybody knows Tarawa in terms of food production. Tarawa is, 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 is the one that um, provides most of the food that feed the whole northern Nigeria, if not the whole of, of, of Nigeria. We want to um, request the support and, and commitment of Your Excellency in making sure that this happens. Governor Kefas, on his part, said he has been in close contact with the activities of the African Development Bank and regretted that the state missed out on the first phase of the SAPZ due to misinformation, but will actively participate in the second phase to boost agricultural activities. He noted that the SAPZ project is private sector driven and assured that the government will provide an enabling environment to make the project succeed. He assured the team of his support to ensure the smooth execution of phase two of the SAPZ project. Taraba is open. Taraba is ready. We have done what we need to do in terms of uh, improving the security in the state. Um, it's still a work in progress. We are still working very hard to flush out all these elements that are threatening business and economic activity in the state. And I'm very, very sure that within the shortest time, Taraba will be the safest place in Nigeria. And I know that we have enough land to accommodate more than what we are starting with now. But I believe that we need to start from somewhere. And at the end of the day, I should rightly say Taraba will not only feed Nigeria, but will feed Africa, and then by extension, the whole world. So I know with you, we can achieve this. The team earlier visited Lao local government area in preparation for the takeoff of the project.